Yo, hello and welcome. Uh, today we're going to talk really briefly about how to set up Asheron's Call emulator or whatever you want to say, emulation to Asheron's Call game. So type in ACE emulator here into Google. Go into here, go to their website. Um, there should be like a, a how to section. Um, how to play there you go FAQ how to play so this will give you like step by step what you need to do so first thing you need to do is you need to download AC install right this AC one install install that on your computer which installs the base Asheron's call retail game so also what you need to do is download the end of retail client files. So these are like the files that make it like Throne of Destiny, the, the expansions. Like you need to update these four files in order to run on the emulators because they all run the retail version or whatever you want to say for the most part. So like this original install is not compatible. You need you have to update these four files in order to play on most servers. So all you do is you just, uh, once you get download those files, it'll be in a zip, you unzip that. Um, let's see, downloads. So AC updates, so you unzip these four files from AC updates, and then copy paste them over your the files, which would be C, so my computer, C, turbine, Asheron's call, and you just copy paste them in this folder, your Asheron's call folder. So it'll say like, you sure you want to replace the files? Like, yeah, you want to replace the four files with the updated four files. So once you do that, you get Thorg Launcher. So you get Thorg Launcher. And once you get that, you just run the Thorg Launcher. And then you can go here down at the bottom. It says browse servers. And you can see like all the different servers that are publicly listed. And then you can just click on one and, and just click add, add server to, to the list. And then you click the name in the list and then put your account and password. Some servers you might have to sign up for, like they might have you make an account and password with an admin. Other ones, you just put what you want your account and password to be in here and launch with that and those credentials. And then it'll just make the account. And then you just have that account now with that account name and password. Cause you logged into that server with it. It's kind of like that. So you just have to remember your account name and password. And then you use Thorg Launcher to play any server. And then, I mean, they have servers like this one I play on where no botting's allowed. You can't combat macro. And you can only multi-box two accounts. I like that one. I play that a lot. I played a lot on Reef Coal where you can just macro as many accounts as you want. And I would macro eight accounts. And there's also Doctide for PvP. There's, there's all kinds of stuff for everybody. So, yeah, that's how you get started. And it's all free. So, that's it. And then if you want to get decal, then there's more information here about decal, but that'll get you started with the basic. And then on Thorg Launcher, uh, I'll just show really quick on Thorg Launcher, you can actually inject decal, which gives you like, so you, even without installing decal exclusively, I think it gives you some functionality, but you know, just install decal if you want that. And that's it. You're ready. You're set to go. So yeah, enjoy. Welcome back to Dareth, Dareth. However you want to say it, Asheron's Cults. It's my favorite game of all time, so emulate it, love it. Peace, one love.